murky skies in Munich for the final. It's been a wonderful week of tennis here at the BMW Open. And we have a final that hopefully will light things up here on court. Mikey Pereira in the commentary box, Mars McLaggen alongside me. It is Jan Lennart Struff to get this one underway. And that is a wonderful <laughs> return from Basilashvili. Why waste any time, eh? Beautifully done. To call the pace off that. So not nine. only wide, but the, the full diagonal of the court that Struff would have needed to cover. It's a great return. Right six, Vincent. Yeah, he's not used to having knees. Ran back down. Not a bad idea. A little bit more confidence, perhaps, just in the play of Struff after a slow start. Basilashvili leads three games to one. Performance by the, the organisers this week as well. Really good hitting. Just able to dictate from the centre of the court. Find a width, keep Struff on the move. Away, well, you can see that the, the rain is getting a, a fair bit heavier right now, and I think there's going to have to be a decision made here. Sort of asking Fergus Murphy, are we going to stop? The decision is yes. They might just stay out on court, though. Might be a just a cloud burst, and <laughs> hopefully it's nothing too set in. Well, this is where you can see that rain's dropping vertically, and this is where that lack of wind doesn't do. 15 all players suspended. What a very warm welcome back to action from Munich here at the BMW Open. A rain delay that we've had in this final has come to an end now. Oh, we stayed there. And he's produced a little Ooh. bit of magic. He's there, that ball's coming quickly off the racket of Struff. Perhaps just uh, overcomplicated, double guessed himself. He was never going to run down and back into the open space, but still the hand skills needed. Look how still that head is, how carefully the eyes watch the ball. Well, he started well, and he has continued on his merry way. Nicholas Basilashvili. First set in the bag, six games to four. <laughs> it's a flashy end to what was a very impressive point for this second set. But Basilashvili has that in his arsenal. You can't fault either player there. Struff again, he's just, he's just trying to ramp the pressure up, look for a crack. Oh, oh. <laughs> nearly tagged him. Yeah, not to be put off with a certain volley, he goes again and... This has really perhaps not seen the gap around the side this time. Kasparud, 6162. The young Norwegian just could not get going against the Georgian. And that was a, a little bit charitable there from Basilashvili. Yeah, just uh, anticipated that Struff was going to make a dash into the open court. Big points, he was able to turn that around, Struff. He was looking second best in that rally. Oh, 
Oh, well put away. Never was going to hold back, was he? No. <laughs> Just got a little too clever again. Well, it's been a match of fine margins, and that is the Five first four. point lost on serve in this breaker. Zexfilly. There goes one. Six five. Bass Celestially. Take a bow, Nicholas Basilashvili. A fine performance, not just in this final, but all week. He has not dropped a set here in Munich as he claims the big prize. It is a fifth ATP Tour title for the Georgian. He loves playing in Germany, twice he's won in Hamburg. And he has added Munich to the collection. A fine display, 6-4, 7-6. Überreicht sie jetzt Michael Rons mit Lederhosen. Und natürlich wollen wir jetzt schauen, ob die auch richtig passt. Eine gescheite Lederhosen passt immer, sagen wir. Well, here we go. It's one of the uh, wonderful things about this event. The traditional Lederhosen have been uh, awarded to the winner. Damen here. And he's going to be given a little bit of privacy just so to, uh, to put them on. <laughs> They've thought of everything. Your shorts. There we go. This must feel quite surreal well, right now for him. I'm really surprised he's came out in a different outfit. Outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Like a magician. Patrick Kühnen sehr gerne beim Anziehen. Yeah, they've all done it. We've seen pictures throughout the years of different players. And yeah. There we go. Oh, I think he pulls them off, you know. And he's smiling. Yes, <laughs> that's what it took. <laughs> We knew he's happy underneath, he said so. I had to be delighted with this play, but... Nicolas, we say, this schaut aber gut aus. Well, the Lederhosen's the trophy, and he will be getting the car as well. Here at the BMW Open. In the Bayerischen Lederhosen.